And welcome back to Let's Play Pokemon Crystal Episode 2! So I did my research, off camera of course. Took like six minutes. Wait, uh... No, actually seven. Anyway, um, so I have decided what my final team is for as long as I can remember. Um... It's gonna of course be Typhlosion. Then we're gonna have, um... Gyarados. Then Victory Bell. Arbuck. Um, Espeon and Togetic, and that should be enough Pokemon for all the HMs. Because of course, as you know, I don't use HM slaves. Heck, <coughs> and this is true until I um. What are you telling me about being careful or something? Um, oh dear. Until I watched um, the Conroy's Emerald, I never even thought that HM slaves were a thing. Like, I didn't know they existed. Because I never thought of them. Because why would I think of them? Because I guess the only good thing about... Oh, critical hits. Um, HM moves is that they force you to have a diverse um, set of Pokemon if you play it the way that I've always known to play it. So interesting, your critical hit's as powerful as your normal hit. Thankfully, you can, in fact, get Eevee early on. Oh, it's a Hoppip. Get Jay Witz on the phone. I mean, it splashed around and had fun. Because Mystery Dungeon would maybe do 5 damage to me in itself, but... Oh my goodness, could you imagine doing any of the Mystery Dungeon bosses, beating them just by using Splash? Like, I'm pretty sure you would have to, like, hack the game in order to do that. As in, like, in order to get, like, a max level jump bluff or whatever, or whatever is the strongest thing they can have. Splash, I guess Gyarados maybe, and then having him fight the lower level bosses so that they don't do as much damage to him. 15, 14, 16, 15, 17. the longest I've stayed in a beginning route ever. <laughs> oh, of course, how very typical. I get a critical hit when it doesn't actually help me. Again. Route 29. Cherry Grove City, New Bark Town. Cherry Grove City. You're a rookie trainer, aren't you? I can tell. That's okay. Everyone is a rookie at some point. If you'd like, I can teach you a few things. Sure, old man. Okay, then follow me. This is a Pokemon Center, they heal your Pokemon in no time at all. You'll be relying on them a lot, so you better learn about them. My po um, my, I'm such a bad trainer, my Pokemon get hurt? No. This is a Pokemon Mart. They sell balls for catching wild Pokemon and other useful items. Route 30 is out this way. Trainers will be battling there. Prize Pokemon there. This is a C, as you can see. 
Some Pokemon are only found only in water. And I'm gonna have to get a surrogate water type. Hi, guy looking at us. Surrogate water type for the time being. Yeah. It's my house. Thanks for your company. Let me give you a small gift. Oh, thanks. I can actually look at my map. And talk about aside from Spoker, he has a map. Okay, yeah, it becomes more useful as you add cards. I wish you luck on your journey. Guy Gent's house. Wow, that old symbol, that old Wi-Fi symbol. Well, internet symbol, whatever. I remember having a flip phone that had that. <coughs> that PC is free for any trainer to use. For a reason, I thought she was a Pidgey for a split second. The communication center upstairs was just built, but they're still finishing it up. It's great, I can store any number of Pokemon and it's all free. Any number? You sure? I mean, there's always a limit. I mean, computers can only hold so many digits. Good morning. Welcome to our Pokemon Center. We can heal your Pokemon to perfect health. Shall we heal your Pokemon? Okay, may I see your Pokemon? Thank you for waiting. Your Pokemon are fully healed. We hope to see you again. Mr. Pokemon's house is still farther up ahead. This is different. When I was walking in the grass, a bug Pokemon poisoned my Pokemon. I just kept going, but then my Pokemon fainted. You should keep an antidote with you. Is this like vending machines? Pokemon can trace. They have fresh shadow Pokeballs. When will they get more of them? How very typical. So I so... Um... Like, amazed playing Platinum and seeing that you actually get Pokeballs immediately. Welcome, how many I help you? How dare you. You can't help anyone. When I get older, I'm going to be a gym leader. I make my Pokemon battle with my friends to make them tougher. You're trying to see how good you are as a Pokemon trainer? You better visit the Pokemon gyms all over Johto and collect badges. Oh yeah, this is Johto. <coughs> when you're with Pokemon, going anywhere is fun. Pokemon gain experience in battle and change their form. Pokemon change? I would be shocked if one did that. Kill it, kill it with fire. When I was a wee lad, I was a hot shot trainer. Here's a word of advice, catch lots of Pokemon. Treat them all with kindness, yeah. Stuff them in digital form, in a digital form. Yeah, actually, isn't sort of PCs like um, Inception sort of thing? Never watched it. I didn't ever watch much movie, many movies. Um, but because we're store, we're turning Pokemon into digital forms in a game that would already be a digital thing. So they're already digital things being moved into a, another digital form. Well, thirty. That's not Pokemon's house, is it? Well, thirty. Violet City, Cherry Grove City. Is this an apricorn guy? <coughs> hey, it's Barry. Obtain Barry. I never knew that they were just called berries originally. Wait, were there only berries? You know, Pokemon eat berries. Well, my Pokemon got healthier by eating a berry. Here, I'll share one with you. Receive Barry. I'll put the berry in the item pocket. Chick trees with berries, they just drop right off. Apricot guy. Oh wow, a ladybug already. Uh, 
Okay, why am I sucking all of a sudden? Aren't you super weak? Apparently not. I guess I must have took it to halfway. 23 experience points. I haven't found antidote. Mr. Pokemon's house? It's a bit farther ahead. Mr. Pokemon's house straight ahead. Oh, very weird to have a sign like, hey, come to my house. It's up, it's up the road. Oh, great, it's a Weedle. Well, here comes poisoning. Fire you ready to burn inside as well as outside? Apparently not. Please be faster than it. Mr. Pokemon's house. Hello, hello. Who must be Zyphrum? Professor Elm said that you would visit. This is what I want Professor Elm to examine. I received Mystery Egg. I know a couple who run a Pokemon daycare service. They gave me that egg. I was intrigued, so I sent mail to Professor Elm. For a Pokemon evolution, Professor Elm is an authority. Yeah, Professor Oak here recognizes that. My assumption is correct. Professor Elm will know it. Hi, Oak. Long time no see. Aha, uh -huh, so you're Zyphrim. I'm Oak, a Pokemon researcher. I was just visiting my old friend, Mr. Pokemon. I heard you were running an errand for Professor Elm, so I waited here. Oh, what's this? A rare Pokemon? Let's see. Hmm, I see. I understand why Professor Elm gave you a Pokemon for this errand. Because again, we're our little disparages of humanity between worlds of vicious monsters everywhere. Like literally, you have to stay in a town or else you'll be dead. Night, Pokemon are our friends. Yeah, sure. He said that you would treat your Pokemon with love and care. Ah, you seem to be dependable. How would you like to help me out? See, this is the latest version of Pokedex. It automatically records data on Pokemon you've seen or caught. Was this supposed to be like the last versions of the game of Pokemon ever? It's a high-tech encyclopedia. So I have received Pokedex. Go meet many kinds of Pokemon and complete that Pokedex. But I stayed too long. I have to get to Goldenrod for my usual radio show. Zyphrim, I'm counting on you. You are returning to Professor Elm? Here, your Pokemon should have some rest. <coughs> I'm depending on you. Whoa, whole pile of strange coins. And hey, they're from another country. From Kanto. Maybe. It's a big computer. Hmm, it's broken. Oh. Is this a carpet or is this a bunch of wires that I'm stepping on? Yeah, maybe it's broken because I'm stepping on those wires. What am I doing? Pokedex. Cynical Fire Mouse, 1 foot 8 inches, 17.0 pounds. Fire that spouts from its back burns hottest. When it is angry, the flaring flames intimidate flows. Flows, foes. Cyndaquil's Nest? Oh! I guess it makes sense what that thing was printing. Game Boy printer is a thing. Interesting. I remember seeing. Well, yeah, okay. H Hello, Zyphrum, it's a disaster. 
Uh, um, it's just terrible. What should I do? Uh, oh no. Please get back here now. Click. Okay. Um... But that reminds me, I remember seeing at my favorite retro shop, I guess. Um, the, they had like a Legend of Zelda Golden Light printer um, thing that, that that was on sale for $600. Yeah. It's a fruit bearing tree. Hey, it's Poison Cure Berry. Okay, Petra Berry. Oh my goodness. It's a bit literal. For a pet. For. What I'm pretty sure must be a Petcha Berry. Are there running shoes? I don't think there's running shoes in this game. I think running shoes exist until Leaf Green. Three damage instead of two. Uh, maybe I'm thinking of level two is doing two damage. You know what? I don't actually think I need to go through the grass for that. Pidgey fainted. Level 9. 17, 15, 18, 16, 18. Well, at least my Pokemon are gonna get really strong really fast. How why is there a ledge in the road? Seems very bad. Was there like an earthquake? Heck, I'm pretty sure that literally happened here a while ago. Do you have eggs? Eggs? Pokeballs? Well, right? I mean, he's not that hurt, but hmm. Oh, it's a kid from outside Elm's lab. You got a Pokemon at the lab. What a waste. A wimp like you. Don't you get what I'm saying? Well, I too have a good Pokemon. I'll show you what I mean. Okay, suddenly blocks cover the area. Is that why we can't run away from trainers? I Question, question, question. Is that why we can't run from trainers? Because just like, from the heavens, like, um, stone blocks just fall straight down and lock us together? Only one will make it out of this arena alive. Oh, totally doll. Oh, are you my rival, considering the fact, you know, you have the Pokemon that's super effective against me? That's Leer? I'm pretty sure that's Laser Beam. My goodness. Please don't tell me, please tell me I'm not gonna lose the intro battle again. Are you kidding me? Okay, good. <laughs> this total battle should not have been able to do that much to me. 70 experience points. Question, 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 was defeated. Humph. Are you happy you won? 300 Poka. My name's question, question, question. I'm gonna be the world's greatest Pokemon trainer. Okay. An ass. Wait, but wouldn't Totodile... Did that kid steal? I think 
think that kid broke into la Elm's lab and stole a total doll. What happened to the Chikorita? I mean, I don't know. Maybe it was just like Pidgey and Wormpool. Yeah, 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 there'd be a Wormpool in this game. No, and um, a Caterpie. Maybe those were the other two stars I could choose from. I like how they knew that people would get annoyed by the random encounter, so they just made trees that you can eventually cut by and just get between here and Cherry Grove really easily. Oh, I need healing. I heard a Pokemon was stolen here. I was just getting some information from Professor Elm. Apparently, it was a young male with long red hair. What? You battled a trainer like that? Did you happen to get his name? Yes, officer. His name is Silver for some unknown reason. Okay, so Silver was his name. Thanks for helping my investigation. Actually, what is that mystery egg? Berry. So I have a store item. Feels feel okay. Cures poison thing. Self cure hope for poke. Okay, so it tells you if it's a hold item. An egg obtained from Mr. Pokemon. I mean, your pack may be... Okay. That's what Select does. It's just what it always does. Zyphrim, this is terrible. Oh, yes. What was Mr. Pokemon's big discovery? I handed the mystery egg to Professor Elm. This? But, is it a Pokemon egg? If it is, it is a great discovery. What? Professor Oak gave you a Pokedex? Zyphrim, is that true? That, that's incredible. He is superb at seeing the potential of po people as trainers. Wow, Zyphrim. You may have what it takes to become the champion. That's because you got a little... You got an encyclopedia. Well, even then, well, You've got a... You were given a, an electronic book. Ebook. You seem to be getting on great with Pokemon, too. You should take the Pokemon Gym Challenge. Closest gym would be the one in Violet City. Zyphon, the road to the championship would be a long one. Before you leave, make sure that you talk to your mom. It contains a Pokemon caught by Professor Elm. Can I steal it? Cypherm! Use these on your Pokedex quest. Thank you! Pokedex, you have to catch Pokemon. Throw Pokeballs at Wild Pokemon to get them. Then put the Pokeball in the ball bucket. means that's gonna be it for this episode so if you enjoy this stare down if you enjoy this video you know what to do see ya